What's going on, money friends? So this is my predictions with the crypto market and just crypto in general. Uh, I think that a lot of it's not gonna last. I mean, a lot of it's just not even good. I mean, if you think about it, a lot of it's just garbage. Um, the technology is all right. Um, I mean, it speeds up. I'll, I'll, I'll give you this. If you want, if people complained about gas fees for Ethereum, they've never had to pay a large fee as a business through Stripe. Because I will tell you that paying, what, two or 3% to Stripe on a couple thousand dollars is way more than paying for gas fees. So I'll give you that. But let's go over some of the things that I think that will happen. I mean, right off the bat, um, all these coins, Pepe, Mike AI, all the AI things are not gonna do, do anything. Those companies are garbage. Uh, they're not really gonna do anything in AI. Gaming, I can go back and forth. I think that uh, the big gaming companies are just gonna have faster systems or incorporate uh, ways to make money in their own uh, ecosystem and not, they might use the technology, but I don't see them doing like, I mean, we already have cryptocurrency. I don't understand, like, like, okay. World of Warcraft Gold. I can, this is digital currencies. Like, I can buy gold from a game and what, 10, 300, 10, okay. For 10,000 gold, it's 40 cents digital gold for real life money i mean this is where the, really how the future is i mean if you want to make money in a game like you make money in, in, a, in a good game that people play and not the trash games that are in in here i mean immutable meh uh not coin meh floki meh uh gala they, gala is the only game company that because they had a past in gaming that i could and with facebook and meta that they could actually do anything beam meh axie infinity games are garbage they owe a lot of money <clears throat> good for uh very people that have a mobile device um and it's going to be a mobile gaming uh where uh third world countries play that's it uh multiverse no not gonna do anything sandverse no shitty block uh Roblox kind of games, Ronin connected with uh, Axie Infinity, Decentralized, same thing, ApeCoin, V, um, I mean, just a brand. Um, Glenn Prime, I don't know what that is, Supervert, and all these other ones are just gone. They're not going to do anything. Yield Gaming Games, uh, Money Play, uh, mm, so look at the Web3, Web2 Gaming of um, uh, Phase, Phase, yeah. I mean, they're bankrupt. Um, Livlium game is garbage, not gonna play. Uh, Pixel, same thing. All, all, all the games, no one's gonna play. Um, Solana, I think Solana's gonna do well. I think the cryptocurrencies that are gonna do well um, and that will probably be around forever um, just because of what I think of uh, the dot-com bubble. I mean, if we just look at the dot-com bubble, it just tells you um, this is the same, uh, same thing. Dot com bubble is the crypto bubble of um, 2024, 2026, whatever, whatever it is, it's going to be. And so you look at the, the the market. Like only six big companies survived from the 2000s until today. eBay. Uh, meh, barely making it compared to Amazon. I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're, they're doing well. I mean, don't get me wrong. Google, again, uh, doing amazing. They have Yahoo, they have, not Yahoo, they have YouTube, they have all sorts of AI. Microsoft just killing it. Cisco's obviously killing it. Yeah, I mean, all great companies, but there is a $5 trillion loss between March 20, 2000 and 2002. Many startups which had high evaluations and little to no revenue went bankrupt. And we can see that with every crypto cycle. I mean, every crypto cycle has a pump and a bust. And the top 10, top 100 cryptos swap in and swap out. 
Tron wasn't here last year. Uh, not Tron. Uh, Ton, Ton wasn't here. I think XRP was down a lot more. Um, Polkadot wasn't up here. Near wasn't up here. Pepe wasn't up here. Internet wasn't here. This Leo coin wasn't here. You know, all Casper wasn't here. Render wasn't here. All these major coins were here. And what are they going to actually do? The next cycle, they're going to run up. When the bull cycle comes, they're going to all get liquidated and then they're all going to go out of business because none of them have any real business model. Um, and that's why we see a lot of the exchanges go bust every cycle too is because they don't have any reserves. They all go on leverage and they hope that the bull run goes forever and it doesn't. And then they just get fucking stomped out. Uh, like, I, this is... USDC obviously is um, connected with some Web2 services. A lot of this, like, Toncoin, which is with uh, uh, Telegram, they're going to be around because they actually have a service that brings in outside capital to, this, uh, to, to run it um, for employees and stuff. Um, it's not like just, it's an, it's an add-on to a real company versus all these other crypto projects aren't. <clears throat> um, Cardano, I don't it's really, I mean, it's, it's, I used to be only always a dollar, always 50 cents, but now it's just, I mean, they're gonna run out of cash. Shib, meme coins do well. All these, uh, Chainlink has a real business and services but a lot of these don't. And so I think a lot of them are gonna crash. I think the major ones are just gonna be um, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Solana, uh, just because, and I'm not talking about like stable coins. I think the exchange coins are gonna go um, because why? why, we don't need them. Um, Solana is just backed by VC, so the VC always has money, so they can just dump money into this all the time. Um, XRP uh, has a lot of Web3, and technology aspects to it with banks. So definitely could see it. Uh, Telegram, Doge, uh, meme, VC funding. Uh, I, a lot of these like meme coins, I definitely think are just big, um, big companies that, uh, big VC companies that have money and they're like, let's just make a, like, let's just make a meme coin, fill with money, invest a lot and just rape returns is what I think a lot of the meme coins are. Um, kind of like what I think the government created crypto um, because it's kind of like one of those things is like, let them, what is it like? You convince everyone that it's their idea to get in this and really it's your idea, you just kind of brainwash them. Uh, I can't remember what the terminology is of that. That's exactly what this is. Um, that's what crypto is, is so they can track every transaction, use AI to s see where money's going, where money's flowing, and put a stop to it or cut off certain points. You don't think, uh, yeah, if you don't think crypto, the government owns crypto, you're crazy. Um, the, what is the, the greatest uh, trick the devil created was think ma making People think he didn't exist or something like that. I don't remember the, 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 the term. If you guys can give me the quote down below, I would really appreciate it. But that's it, guys. I think that um, there's going to be a few coins that are going to be left out of the dot-com crypto bubble. Um, a lot of them, all the money is going to get pulled out of the biggest coins uh, that are memes and have no real businesses and then just dump into Bitcoin and all of those and that's going to raise up those values um, and I think that's what's going to happen so let me know what you guys think down below and I'll see you guys on the next one